Hi Karis, so today we're going to be learning how to make this lovely headpiece. In the process you would learn how to make this double banded um, Alice band. Yeah, I'm going to teach you how to make that with two Alice band. Uh-huh. And then we'll form this lovely headpiece. But before we get into that, who won our giveaway prize for last week? And it is Otibo DJ. Congratulations. Please do contact us in the link below the Ventcraft Academy reception and make a request for your gift. You want to attend the Ventcraft Academy class six classes for free. Wow. Okay, let's get into today's tutorial. So today we'll be needing our mannequin head, our hot glue glow with our candle glue, of course, already inserted. Or if you don't have, you can put it in. Then your measurement tape, your pegs, your uhu gum, scissors, some trimmings like stone trimmings. Uh, I call them stone trimmings. What do you call them? Do let me know in the comment section below. And our two Alice band. All right. Then we have our fascinator veil. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is place the bigger size Alice band on the um, mannequin head and I would connect my fascinator veil like so. Now, if you want to cover the head, of course, you pull more out down, but this is the way I wanted it to be. Then I'm going to remove the pegs and start putting my glue. Now, you use the, um, tr the tread, put it on the tread so that you don't have gum stains all over. Just put little glue on it. If you want to get it accurately, B6000 will work perfectly here, here instead of Uhu if you're not so good with using the glues yet. So I put it all the way around to hold the fascinator veil firmly. And next thing I did was to cut it, trim it in a way that it will hold, it will lap on the head. So you have to check how it will lap on the head and cut it at that part. You want it really looking smooth on the head surface. After that, I took the other Alice band, which is... A bit slimmer okay and I put my uhu gum at the two tips can you see I put it where the other tip will be there and at the other side and that's how I form my double layered Alice band did you see how it goes very lovely so you can do this with any of them I believe it was my first trial what do you think do give me a thumbs up I think it deserves a thumbs up pause this video and give me a thumbs up all right back to our tutorial so the next thing I did was to take the trimmings and I'm going to cover up the down layer and the top. Keep watching and learning. Remember, if you can't find any of these items used in making this headpiece in your local store, you can check the links in the description of this video to place your orders. Okay, so I finished co covering the down layer and what I did was I took the stones, cut them into small, small bits with a pattern and I'm standing them up there. If my hand covered it up, but if you stay to the very end, you will see how I placed it to stand. Now I'm doing the top layer. Keep watching and learning. Okay, so our game challenge is coming up a bit earlier today on this video and the, ch the question is what is coming up on the 20th of July of 20th of July yeah what occasion is coming up on 20th of July so I'm going to pick up someone and you're going to attend all our 12 classes in the Ben Craft Academy for free can you imagine that Okay, so watch this carefully so you see how to stand the stone pieces on top of the Alice band. So I put my hot glue, my glue on the piece and I put it like this erected, standing up like that and press it in to stand. And that's how I made this unique acquire bomb head piece. If you want to see more, you need to subscribe to this great channel and click the bell for notification when I put up new videos. Thank you for watching this video.